Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just in my kitchen. I'm prepping dinner and I'm um, waiting for some stuff so I figured I would do my Sephora haul. Um, I got some things for myself and my sister because she needed some things and I'm VIB so I got during their VIB and Rouge sale I got 15% off my entire bill. I used to be VIB Rouge but I haven't been buying as much makeup. So Let's dig in and see what we got. Um, I don't even remember what I, <laughs> what I ended up getting for myself, to be honest. So we'll see. And I had some... Um, well, I have a ton of rewards. I've just been saving them. Um, I think I'm going to turn it in for one thing. I don't know. Let's see. So I got some samples. Um, Joe Malone London Nectarine Blossom and Honey. Smells good. And this is a Invictus Legend. I think it's for men. Um, I picked it up because Brayden likes these. So he'll enjoy that. Um, let's see what we got. Alright. So this is, I turned this in um, from my rewards. It's Tokamaya. It's a perfume. So. And it says love yourself made in the u.s um i just like look at the really so hey so leave it she's going nuts at the dog outside drives me crazy um that smells pretty it's a little roller um so i figured that's it was like 100 points they didn't really have anything that was bigger that was Available, they were all sold out, so I just got that little thing. Um, all right, so Bite Beauty they did away with a shade called Kava, and then I found out that it came back, so I ordered another one. It's a very pretty 100% natural, um, it's a lipstick. I've I'm like got like this much left of my tube, and I was so glad to see that it was back, um, because it's like the perfect new, like like purpley nude I can't even describe it it's like a beautiful shade and it's so pretty I don't want to swatch it but it's pretty I'll have to use it in a tutorial and like they're made out of natural products so you could literally eat it but I wouldn't suggest doing that um but I love the packaging it's like super sleek smooth um and each um there's like different uh little things they have so that's Kava. So that's a repurchase for me. I needed a new one and I was glad to see that they had it back. This is a new thing. Um, Charlotte Tilbury. This is a eyes to mesmerize, long lasting, easy color. So it's a cream shadow and makeup by Tiffany V. Posted um, this in her video. So, hey, really? Stop. Oh my gosh, I'm going to have to put her in her crate. I'll be right back. So, uh, Makeup by Tiffany D talks about this all the time. It looks like super usable, like something you could do every day. And she does a really pretty eye look with it. So I was like, dude, I'm getting it. And this is in shade Marie Antoinette. And it's just like right up my alley. So, it doesn't really have a scent. Maybe it looks like it melted a little bit in the pan. So it's kind of disappointing. It looks a little funky. Um, but hopefully... It'll be okay. So I'm going to give that a try. And love the packaging too. Very pretty. And it's like a very sturdy glass thing. Um, so that was that. That's a new purchase for me. Um, and this is another recommendation from Makeup by Tiffany D. This is a Buxom Lip Gloss Flumping Lip Polish in the shade Kimberly. Um... I need another lip gloss like I need another hole in the head, but I wanted to try it. And when you have, oh gosh, is that ever pretty? When you have 15% off, 
you can't go wrong. Um, so this looks stunning. It's the full on plumping lip polish. Um, it's like a light glittery pink, but I feel like it's gonna be nice with anything you put it with. It smells amazing, let's see what happens. What's mine? I have nothing on my lips today. Okay. It's got a nice applicator. Someone's coming home. I can stop. Let's see what happens. Okay, I'm totally back. Brooke came home, so that's who was coming through the garage. Um, but I put this buxom gloss on. You can't really see it, but it's a limp pl a lip plumper, so it feels tingly and weird. I'm not sure I like it. I might have to take that one back. We'll see. Um. <sighs> My sister uses this liner from Urban Decay 24-7. It's called Whiskey. Um, it's a brown shade. She uses it all the time. I got it for her a couple years ago, and she's repurchased it a couple times since then. So it's a nice brown shade. And then I got myself one that I've never, never tried before because it looks like a cool color. Um... It's called Love Drug, and let's take a look and see. With these 24-7 liners, like, I'm obsessed with them. I use them all the time. So it's like a, like, sort of like a wine color, it looks like. I don't want to scratch it. Maybe I will. It's very pretty. So you can see the little reflex in it. It's nice. I wear a lot of this shade, so I think I'll get a lot of use out of that. And then um, the other things that I got for her are They're Real. This is the mini. We've been using these instead of the full size. They're $12. They're half the price. And I feel like it doesn't dry out as quick as the big ones do. So I um, just got her that. And she needed a new mineral foundation. They did not have the It Cosmetics Celebration Foundation that she liked, but she's in shade light, and I got her the um, Your Skin But Better CC Airbrush Perfecting Powder, and I think this will do the same thing. Um, so let's take a look and see. Because I use the It Cosmetics Celebration Foundation Illumination. And that's got like a little bit of like a glow to it. I'm like gonna ruin her box. This is annoying. They're so hard to get open. Um, but this is in shade light. It looks like that. And that's the shade. So, um, Smells fine, looks good. Hopefully she will like it, and if not, I will return it for her. But she's like, just get me whatever. So I did. Um, I guess that's it for this little mini haul, but I wanted to show you what I got during the VIB sale. And um, I guess that's it. So I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye.